great pleasure now to welcome uh, Ramesh Pandey, Dr. Ramesh Pandey, who is a radiation oncologist in Palmerston North in New Zealand, uh, but we're talking to you today in Singapore, which feels amazing. Welcome. Can you tell me, cancer patients in New Zealand, do some struggle to get access to radiation therapy that could benefit them? Absolutely, Julie. We've got a quite a unique situation. We've got a small population that's dispersed throughout a large uh, uh, region. And now some of our patients travel three hours, two hours just to get to the appointments, for investigations, for treatments. And some treatments, as you're aware, can last up to six weeks, 30 sessions. So getting people to attend appointments is a big problem big issue um, and staying the course for that period of time away from family, friends, business can cause a huge amount of burden on the families and also financial hardships. And what will help improve access so that everybody who could benefit actually gets the radiation? What, what are you trying to do now and what more do you hope to do? There's a lot that has been started already. There's still a lot more to be done. Uh, for instance, we found that uh, having linear accelerators close by to patients is probably a step in the right direction. In, in the last few years, there has been a move to try and increase the number of uh, replacements that we're doing for our older machines, and that changes uh, the treatment times. So it's shorter, and potentially we might use more sophisticated techniques that re reduce the overall duration of the patient being away from for family and friends and work. And the, the development of the workforce, the training of the workforce, that's a critical issue, isn't it, in terms of improving access? Oh, Julie, that's a, an, an item close to my heart. Um, we see a lot of trainees come. We train them very well, uh, but they don't always stay, unfortunately. Um, and then we've got this also uh, added issue of our workforce retiring soon. A large number of our current radiation oncologists will retire in a very short while. New Zealand is actually at the edge of a cliff in terms of radiotherapy services. And unless we actually take stringent action to try and remedy this, we as a country will be struggling to provide quality care in a timely fashion for our patients. Ramesh, thank you so much for talking to us. Most welcome. Wherever we live, we deserve the best possible chance to survive cancer and receive the treatment that will benefit us. Our families should be able to get access to radiation therapy if they need it. Right now, in Australia and New Zealand, there are cancer patients that are struggling to get the radiation therapy that they need. In some parts of the world, it's impossible for cancer patients to get radiation therapy. The Targeting Cancer campaign is supporting the work to close the care gap in radiation therapy at home and abroad. To learn more and find out how you can help, please visit the Targeting Cancer website.